Is it okay to oversize your solar panel array relative to your inverter? Hi, I'm Finn Peacock, the founder of Solar Quotes. It is perfectly okay to put more panels on your roof than your inverter capacity. What am I talking about? Say you have a three kilowatt inverter. It makes sense that you might only put three kilowatts of panels on your roof to match the inverter, yeah? Of course, but I'm here to tell you that it's actually perfectly okay and encouraged to put more solar panels on your roof than your inverter capacity. In fact, under the Australian regulations, you can happily put up to a third more panels on your roof. So if you have a three kilowatt inverter, you can put up to four kilowatts of panels on your roof. First of all, that sounds a bit nutty and it sounds like you might blow up your inverter. Let's put you at ease about that. The way inverters work is they pull power from the solar panels. The solar panels do not push power into the inverter. So the inverter will never pull more power from the panels than it can handle. So it's totally safe. In fact, in theory, you could put 30 kilowatts of panels into a three kilowatt inverter and it would be safe. But we're not doing that. We're putting up to a third more. But more to the point, it's actually there's three main advantages to having more solar on your roof than your inverter capacity. And I'll go through those three reasons now. Number one, in winter, when it's overcast, in the morning, in the afternoon, early evening, the sun isn't very strong. If you've got four kilowatts of panels on your roof, for example, you'll be pumping out a third more power than a three kilowatt system, but you'll still be well below three kilowatts because the sun isn't at its peak strength. Also, you get the maximum output from your panels when it's really sunny, but really cold because temperature actually degrades the efficiency of solar panels. So your solar panels very rarely work at 100%. So by having more solar panels on your roof, you're actually getting a lot more power over the course of the day and on overcast days and in winter. And that means you've got more solar power to use in your house. You're saving more money. Number two, economically, the way the solar rebate works is it's based on the amount of panels you've got, not on the size of your inverter. You basically get paid per panel. So it's actually very cost effective to add panels. So you might as well add as many panels as you can up to 33% more than the rating of the inverter. It makes economic sense. It's just how the rebate's been set up. Talk to your installer about it. The smart installers totally get this. Number three, the third advantage of having more panels on your roof than your inverter capacity will allow is that these pain in the butt <laughs> distributors, so that's the guys that look after the poles and wires going into your house, especially in Queensland, and, but increasingly so in the rest of Australia, are putting hard limits on the size of the inverter. So if you're in Queensland, your local distributor might say, five kilowatt inverter maximum. So what you do is, you put your five kilowatt inverter in, but you put 33% more panels. So what's that? That's about six and a half kilowatts, say, of solar panels on your roof. You have a five kilowatt inverter. To all extents and purposes, you've actually got a six and a bit kilowatt system. Um, but you're still, you know, keeping the distributors happy with their stupid rules. Um, I, I could make a whole video on why that rule's a bit daft. So the three reasons why you should oversize your system, you get more power, You throughout the day, in winter, in the morning, and in the afternoon when you actually need the power. Two, the solar rebate is based on the amount of panels, so it's actually quite cheap to add panels to a system. Talk to your installer, you might be surprised at how cost effective it is. And number three, it's one tool we've got in our box to get around these stupid inverter sizing restrictions that increasingly the electricity companies are imposing on us.